Hello. So, we are gonna set up the other model on Unity to upload it uh, into VRChat. So first of all, you need to open Unity Hub. Uh, you need to create a new project with the uh, 2018.4.20 F1 version. Uh, keep this in 3D and name it. And create. When your project is open, you can go for the VHAT website to get the SDK3 avatar on the download page. Then you're gonna go into Assets, Import Package, Custom Package, and you're gonna look for it. So VHAT SDK3 avatar, open. And on this, you click all and import. You'll get that window when it's over, so you, you can close it. Uh, now, you're gonna get the dynamic bone assets on the asset store. And import. You can close this again go back to your scene and now you're gonna import the other so assets import custom and this one here you need to click on reload and you can close those two windows First of all, you're going to open the scene in here and select the model you want. Choose yours and hide the others. For me, it's going to be the other male VR, so I'm going to click on the other ones and hide them in here. Then I'm going to import one of my textures. And then in here, you can drag your textures. I prepared my body. So for the body texture, and only for this one, you need to click on it and check alpha is transparency and also push the max size to 4K, then apply. Now you can go into your materials and select the good one, which is body M. Go back to your folder, take the map and drag it in here. It worked. For the blush animation, you need to make a texture so open Krita and then go for your body texture and you will need to get the blush layer and drag it into Krita as a new layer and simply save as blush as a PNG file then you can go back to unity and drag it do the same than before and here is the material you need to change the blush it's the same for the four avatars, so just use this one. Check that the name is the blush one. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
So when you've replaced all your textures, uh, you are already ready to upload them. But if you want, for example, uh, remove the color and get a thicker neck, you can open the prefab by right clicking your model and unpack the prefab. And then you can delete the color first. And in body, you can unwrap the blend shapes. Look for the neck one, the neck key and use it. When you're good, you can go to VHAT SDK button, show control panel. On the first tab, you need to see in, and then you have to go in builder and auto fix the issues. Then when it's done, you can click on build and publish for windows. You can close that window name your avatar and click on this then upload and you're good.